In this lesson we're going to talk about how to list the factors of numbers. So let's start with the number 42. So our goal here is basically to list every pair of numbers that multiply together to make 42. Now the way I like to do this is to start with the very easiest possible pairing. And that of course is 1 and 42. We know that 1 times 42 is 42. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my 1 over here on the left. I'm going to leave a whole bunch of space. And I'll put 42 over here on the right. And now I'm going to try the next largest number. So now let's try 2. Okay, well I know 2 goes into 42 because 42 is an even number. So I definitely know 2 goes here, but now I have to figure out what number goes with it. So to do that, I'll just do my long division down here. 2 goes into 4, of course, twice. Drop my 2 down, 2 goes into 2 once. So I know that 21 is the number that goes with 2. Now, how about 3? I also know that 3 goes into 42 because when I add 4 plus 2, I get 6, and 6 is divisible by 3, so therefore 42 is also divisible by 3. So I'll go ahead and figure out what number goes with 3 by doing my long division. So 3 goes into 4 one time, multiply, get 3, subtract, get a remainder of 1, drop down my 2, 3 goes into 12 four times. So that means 14 is the number that goes with 3. Now 4, let's see. Well, the way I know that 4 does not go into 42 is because notice when I divided by 2 I got an odd number of 21. Okay. One way to think of dividing by 4 is it's dividing by 2 twice. So if when I divided by 2 I had gotten an even number then 4 would definitely go in. But since I got an odd number, I know that 4 is not a factor of 42. I know 5 is not a factor of 42 because it does not end in 5 or 0. But I do know 6 is a factor of 42. Because if ever a number has 2 as a factor and 3 as a factor, 6 automatically is also a factor. And so to figure out what goes with 6, well we should know that we know that 42 divided by 6 is 7 just by knowing our multiplication facts. So the number that goes with 6 is 7. And at this point I know I'm finished because if I go any higher I'm just going up to 7 and I've already got 7 in the list. And so what I'm doing here is starting with the easiest thing which is 1 times the number and then I'm working my way in and when the numbers in the middle get really, really close to each other, or maybe um, in this case they're one apart, they won't always be one apart, but when they get close to each other, we'll know for sure that we are done with our list. Let's take a look at 66. We'll start the same way. I'll put a 1 here. I'll put a 66 over here. I know that 2 goes into 66 because 66 is even. I'll do my long division down here to see what goes with it. 2 goes into 6 three times. Drop my 6 down. 2 goes into 6 three times. And so I know that the number that goes with 2 is 33. I also know that 3 goes into 66 because 6 plus 6 is 12. And 12 is definitely divisible by 3, so we'll go ahead and divide 66 by 3. 3 goes into 6 twice. Drop down the 6, goes in twice. And so 22 is the number that goes with 3. 4, once again, 4 doesn't work because 33 is odd, and that's what we got after we divided by 2 once. 5 doesn't work because it doesn't end in a 5 or 0. And so 6 definitely works. 
So let's see what goes with 6. If you happen to know your multiplication facts for 11s, you probably already know the answer to this. What we end up getting is 11. Now I'm not sure if there's anything in between here. Let's see. 7. Um, now in the last video I gave a bunch of shortcuts for figuring out whether a number goes into a given number or not. Um, we didn't really give a shortcut for 7, so with 7s you just kind of got to try it. Let's see. 7 would go into 66 9 times is all because 7 times 9 is 63. We have a remainder so 7 doesn't work. Since 4 didn't work, I know 8 can't work. So now we're up to 9. Can 9 work? Well, remember, we have a trick here. 6 plus 6 is 12. Is 12 divisible by 9? No, it's not, so it can't be divisible by 9. It's not divisible by 10 because it doesn't end in a 0. And now we're all the way back up to 11, but we've already got 11 in the list. So at this point, I know I'm finished.